Hi, in this session, we'll be covering the end to end interior designing CRM software demo. In this video, you will be getting a complete clarity on how you can use CRM software for your interior designing business. Now, if you take solid performers, it is a perfect suit for interior designing. And I'm going to use this CRM to show the complete demo of the interior CRM software requirement. Coming to the dashboard of Solid Performance CRM. Solid Performance CRM has got the option to manage your target versus achievement and what are the enquiry details and prospects and what is the payment received, what are all the deal pipelines that you're having for the month and your raw deal value and prospect values in the dashboard. Now, apart from this, you also have the option to build your custom dashboard with graphical representations. So now in this dashboard, you can add various elements that belongs to various module. For example, if you want to see a graphical representation of various enquiries on various stages, you can be able to see that with the help of the custom dashboard. Moving on to enquiry module, which is the primary module for interior designing business. You can be able to manage all your enquiries from various channels in the CRM effectively. You can be able to add the leads manually one by one or you can be able to bulk upload the leads or you can be able to integrate any of the lead providing sources directly with the CRM. For example, if we take Just Dial, Facebook, Google Ads, India Mart, any of these sources can be used as an integration medium and whenever you receive a lead in that panel, it will come directly to the CRM. There is no need for you to add the leads manually at that point in time. It will be received directly in the CRM. And the beauty is it will also get allocated to your sales executive on an automated manner. For example, in our Facebook lead integration settings, you can define to which person this particular lead needs to be allocated and it will get allocated to those sales executive. In case if you select multiple sales executives, it will get allocated on a rotational basis as well. Once a lead is received in the CRM, you can be able to perform lots of automations. So these automation includes email, WhatsApp, SMS or push notification automation. Let me take email automation as an example and the same functions are available in other automation panel as well. You can be able to add a trigger. So this trigger means whenever a new lead is received, then you want to send an email to this particular lead with what should be the subject and what should be the message. In this message, you can also be able to include short codes or dynamic content. So this means if a person named Sam is making an enquiry, then mail will be sent like, hi Sam, we have received your enquiry. One of our executive will get in touch with you shortly. In a similar way, you can be able to set up a notification alert for your sales executives also so that they will not be missing any kind of follow-ups or any kind of new leads which was allocated to them. And with the help of solid performance advanced automation, you can also be able to set delayed automation. This means if a new enquiry is received today, you can send an automated mail after 24 hours or after a week. These kind of automation will be really helpful in nurturing the leads. And most important thing is you can be able to create any number of automations. There is no restriction on adding the automation. And once a lead is received in the CRM, you can be able to perform follow up for the particular lead. And whenever a new lead is allocated, it will be flag on top so that we will not miss the new lead. Let me show you the complete flow of one particular lead so that you will get an idea of how to use this effectively. Let me show you the complete flow of one particular lead so that you will get a complete idea of how you can use this interior CRM for your business. Let me add a new lead. So while adding a new lead, default fields are available over here, but these fields can also be customized as per your business requirement. For example, you don't want this company name, we can remove this. If you want to add a new particular field, we can be able to add this. All these things are possible in our settings panel directly and you can be able to do this without any kind of technical support. So I'm just adding a new lead as Aman. So once a new lead is added, by default, the lead came with the stage and status as unattended. Now this lead got allocated to a telecaller in case it comes via automation. And whenever a new lead is allocated, they will be intimated with the flag as I informed already. And they are performing the follow up. So they are calling this particular lead and this particular lead is telling that give me a call after two days as I'm traveling. At this point in time, what your executive can do is they can be able to add a new follow up. So they can select after two days time from today and what time they have to make a call. And they can change the stage to unattended can be there or they can also change it to any other stages. Now these stages are also completely customizable as per your business flow. 
For now, I'm keeping it as unattended and I'm changing the status to spoke. Now, once an update is added, after two days, you will be getting a notification alert on top. And from this, you can be able to see this particular lead and you can be able to perform the follow. For example, if you see in my leads panel, there are 12 leads. And if I go to the pending follow-ups, there are only six follow-ups which I need to perform for today. And again, if I click on this particular view page on that particular day, and if I go to this follow up tab, I will be able to see whatever the previous update that I have added. In this way, I will be having a complete idea of what is the previous communication I had with the lead. And even if you update a multiple updates, let me add another update. So I'm just adding again the next update with the next follow up date and time. And in here, I'm just changing the stage to consultation. Now I have added two particular follow ups for a particular lead. And if I go to the view section and go to the follow up tab, both the lead updates will be available. Now in our CRM, you can be able to store unlimited communication history. So if you are having 20 follow ups with this particular lead, all the entire history of communication, whatever you had with this particular enquiry will be available in this panel. So even if an executive changes or even if the lead got allocated to somebody else in your team, they will be having a complete idea of what has happened and how they need to take care of it from now on. So on top, we have given the enquiry module and that is this prospects module. The difference between enquiry and the prospects module is the prospects are the one who are highly qualified. They can be your next customer if everything is taken care in a proper way. So what you are doing is instead of handling all the enquiry in the enquiry module itself you are converting this particular enquiry into a prospect and you are managing their data in that prospect and if you consider interior designing crms they will be using this primarily to involve multiple team members in this kind of activity for example when you're engaging with a prospect at that time you might need to involve a designer or a senior manager to get a code so these kind of multiple people will be working on the same prospect to close the prospects at that time, you can also involve multiple people. Now, the beauty of Solid Performance CRM is you can be able to convert this particular enquiry into a prospect directly in one click. And when you convert, the name, contact details along with that complete history will get transferred to the prospects module. And at this point, you can also be able to add additional executives. For example, you can add the designer or you can add another manager. So like this, you can be able to add multiple team members for this particular prospect and save the update. Now what will happen is whenever any update is happening for this particular prospect, all the three of these people can be able to see the updates. So in this way, the fast tracking of closure will happen and you will not miss out any follow-ups at any point in time. And as I mentioned earlier, even in here, if you go to the follow-ups, whatever follow-up you have done in the enquiry stage, all those updates will be available over here and whenever you want to create a quotation for a particular prospect or enquiry you can be able to create a quotation from this panel itself or you can go to the quotation module also to create a particular quotation now if i come to the quotation module we have got an option to create templates where in which you can create multiple templates and keep it and you can fetch these templates while creating a quotation you can be able to add the details of the items either from the drop down or you can be able to add the items manually if you select the items from the drop down still you can be able to change the pricing as per your requirement and if there are different tax variations based on your country or state you can also change the tax details and you can also add discount in case if you want to add discount now upon adding all these things you can simply click on add a quotation and create a quotation and once a quotation is created you can be able to download this quotation in a pdf format or you can be able to send this quotation directly by whatsapp or by email moving on to the customer module how we have converted the enquiry to a prospect in a similar way you can convert a prospect to a customer as well sometimes you might want to convert an enquiry directly to a customer that is also possible and if you want to add a prospect directly that is also possible so we have got all the combinations of options for you to add and manage your data in an effective way so in the customer module again all the stages which are available here can be completely customized as per your business flow and how you are taking care of things in implementing a project for a particular client and you can also have the due dates and the follow-ups in the client module so in a similar way how we have converted the prospect to customer you can be able to convert the quotation to bill also and in quotation we also have got the option to 
manage all your revisions. So if you are editing and updating a particular quotation, all the history of updates whatever you have done will be available in the system so that you can be able to refer this at any point in time. Moving on to the projects module which is primary for interior designing companies. You can have multiple projects and you can link these projects with your customers and for every project you can create multiple subtasks also. So this is the project view and if you switch you can be able to switch to the task view. Both options are available and whenever you are updating a status for a particular task or project it will get reflected to all the team members panel as well. And for a project you can involve multiple team members and all the statuses which is available over here are completely customizable as per your particular business. Though this CRM is for interior designing, some interior designing company will operate different from other companies flow. In that case also it can be completely customized as per your requirement within methods. Moving on to products, you can be able to add all your products like raw materials and other details over here and these are all the data which we have fetched while creating the quotation. So under the finance module, you can be able to add your income and expenses. So these income and expenses can be linked with the customer or with a particular material or items as well. We have our users module. So in the users module, you can be able to add users and whenever you are creating a user, you can be able to assign user role for them. For example, if you are creating a role called interior designer and you want them to access only the customer and the project data, then they will be having access to do only this and they will not be able to add or delete any data. They will be having permission only to see and update the data. So now these kind of restrictions also you can be able to provide with the help of our user role section. And in case if an employee leaves the company, you can be able to ban the user so that their access will be completely restricted. Moving on to the timesheet module, you can be able to monitor your employees attendance directly online with the help of solid performance CRM. Now these attendance, they can be able to do it out of office also. And in many situations, the project managers, will be working in the field and at that time also they can be able to punch in with the help of our mobile app. Coming to reports, we have got a variety of reports as per your requirement and apart from that we also provide you with the option to create a custom report. Using custom report you can be able to create any kind of reports as per your need and download the data in excel for any kind of future references. This covers the primary functions of interior designing CRM software demo and you can just Take our live one-on-one -on -one demo if you need more clarity on this. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hit the like button if you like this video and subscribe to our channel for more videos. Thank you.